What's going on YouTube? It is the one, the only Duck Killer bringing you a video here today. And I'm just bringing you a quick little uh, intro just to let you know that I'm going to be dropping a new series soon. And I don't know, I'm kind of excited for it. I was laying in bed and kind of thought of the idea. So hopefully it catches on and hopefully, you know, y'all decide that that's something that y'all want to see. Um, pretty much my idea was to go ahead and have a series where I'm just going to talk about life. And it can be about anything. It can be about my life. It can be about, uh, you know, my opinions about what's going on in life. You know, it can be about giving advice. I mean, I don't have that much advice to give. But it can be about giving advice. It can be just about anything. Um, that's just what I want to center the series on. It's going to be called Life Talks with Duck Killer. And pretty much, uh, I hope to just make the videos, you know, like 10 minutes and share some, like, experiences that I've had and then maybe offer advice if someone specific in the comment section has something to say then you know I'll be able to say something there but overall it's not going to be like anything set in stone like some script or anything like that it's just going to be me having a good time you know uh just saying what's on my mind and talking about random stuff essentially um the the gameplays that I'll be having in the background will fluctuate um I have a couple gameplays already say that are just pub videos just me just playing puzzles with friends and just dropping decent numbers uh decent enough to you know where i could put a video over it and not gonna receive too much hate for it um so if that's something that you would like to see make sure to leave a like on this video guys and comment on what you know you think the first video should be about i'm open like i said to anything um and then i'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of this first video being like an intro to the series and then i'm just gonna talk about what's been going on with cod for me so uh, as you know, Pickle and I have teamed for about a year and some change now. Um, since Ghost, we've been playing together for a while and just having a good time, just enjoying playing Call of Duty together and growing and, you know, just, just really enjoying each other's company. So, um, recently, uh, he decided to part ways and he went and joined a team. Um, he played on that team for a little bit and then got me to come try out for that team. So, tried out for the team. It, you know, it went well. The scrims went well. It was a little, um, it was a little weird. I was in, like, a weird phase of my gameplay where I was still trying to figure out, you know, what I really wanted to do with the bow. Uh, I was just experimenting with a lot of stuff, guys. I'll be honest. Uh, I wasn't being real consistent just because I was just experimenting. I wasn't, for whatever reason, I didn't have faith in my shot when I was playing uh, for like a two, two and a half week span there and I, I didn't know how to get out of that cycle but what I ended up doing was, uh, now this is going to sound weird, I actually put my sensitivity down to two just to make sure you know that my shot was lined up because that's, I mean guys, that's literally how little faith I had in my shot at the time and uh, as bad as that is to say, you know, it was, it was just, I was lacking confidence and I think it showed in my gameplay and my gun skill at the time uh, but Needless to say, you know, I played with them for two nights. They decided uh, that, hey, that you know, I'd, we'd like to play with you. You know, you're on the team uh, and everything. So I said, okay, awesome, that's cool. Like, I really jumped at the opportunity to team with Pickle again. I, I really like playing with him. You know, he's a person that has a similar play style to me. We play off each other well and just have a good time when playing. And up to this point, Pickle was telling me, you know, he... He had the same thing going with these guys, so it should be a good fit. So we played and scrimmed for like a day. And then that night, we just really didn't play well. And I guess that really comes down to, uh, I mean, it was all of us. I'll be honest. All four of us did just did not play well. And um, I guess as the new guy, I kind of got most of the blame put on me, especially since I was the AR. Uh, it was just whenever you're missing shots and you're not really getting the help um, you need when trying to hold down everything, uh, it, just, it was just causing you know, uh, us not to play well is causing tension within the team, so, um, I, we were playing scrims, they decided, you know, one of them was like, hey, we're gonna get off, that was cool, uh, me and Pickle were playing together, and then I, I was gonna head to bed, I checked Twitter, and I saw they were tweeting out for team scrim, so I tweeted Pickle, and was like, hey, like, are y'all trying to scrim, what's up, and they were like, oh, actually, they want to run with other guys, so I was like, oh, alright, so, I mean, you know, you offer me a spot on the team, and, you know, within a day, you know, that kind of ends. So, uh, I I was a little disappointed that they handle it that way. And mainly I was disappointed, you know, in Pickle, I guess. Uh, I felt like, I don't know, I felt like maybe he, like, could have been like, yo, like, why don't we just give him another day? Like, we were all off, like, this and that. And, I don't know, I felt like I just got thrown under the bus for, essentially, what I'm going to say, no reason. Because I did, uh, I, 
I played okay those days. It wasn't like it was all on me, but for whatever reason, you know, it got put on me, and that's cool. I mean, me and Pickle are still cool. I'm still cool with the other two guys um, that were that were part of that team. Like, I, I don't hold grudges for long, uh, you know. It's 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 not the end of the world, um, you know. Like I said, just a little disappointed, but it is whatever. I'm currently a free agent. I'd like to go to Cali if at all possible, but you know, I guess there's no set in stone thing that I'll be able to go because I need to find a team that I feel confident in. Um, but that's just a little intro video, guys. If you liked it, please make sure to like, favorite, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter and Twitch. They'll both be down in the description below. I've started up live streaming again, guys. Uh, like I said, just make you know every like and share really helps. Until next time. Peace.